when I get so overwhelmed, things go wrong in my life. When the pain and the sadness seeks in, I always write and it always helped me heal through some things. After losing my best friend, my husband, it got rough every day, every night. Hard for me to sleep, hard for me to get out of bed. I felt like I didn't want to see sunshine and I just kept wondering why I gotta go through this again. Losing so many people that I love in my life, it just put such a damper in your heart. But the lose part of you is even worse. Because when you get married, the Word of God says you become one. He always felt my pain and heard my cry. I always felt his pain and heard his cry. So when I lost him, it felt like I lost a part of me. So as I was laying there full of tears last night, he came to me and let me know that he is all right. And he wanted me to make a video. He said, you love doing things, so make a video so you can watch every day to know that I am all right. The funny thing, I picked up his house coat and I bust out in tears. And my son walked in the room and he said, Mommy, he put his hands on my back, just like my husband used to do. And he stroked my back, rubbing me. And he kissed my forehead, just like my husband did. And said, Mommy, it's gonna be all right. We're gonna get through this. Right there showed me that my Shug, my Roosevelt, my David was right there. His spirit is still with us. So I'm going to leave this what I know he would like for me to share with his children and his loved ones, even especially to me. My prayers have all been answered. I finally arrived. The healing that has been delayed now been realized No one's in a hurry No more schedules to keep I'm enjoying Jesus Just sitting at His feet If you could see me now I'm walking streets of gold If you could see me now I'm standing tall and whole If you could see me now You'd know I've seen him face to face If you could hold sorrows they never can compare what Jesus has in store for me no language could ever share Thank you.